One thing about a quick exorcism, and if the actual ritual seems to take hold at least the first day, um, what seems to happen is there's always a relapse. Okay, and when dealing with the demonic, we are actually physically in a battle. Okay, we are like boxing with them. We're boxing with the demonic. Understand that we have the advantage because the demonic is very intimidated because we have power that he does not have. And as a result, he is actually frightened. He's frightened of the presence of an exorcist who actually is called by God, who could actually uh, go into this battle and actually win. And as I said, even if the exorcist is, is successful in driving out the demon that first day, um, the odds are the, it's called a retaliated spirit will come back. Okay. Mm -hmm. And, uh, and so I mean, it has to be done. I think that there's a there's a, a lot of er, uh, avenues we can explore here. There's a point of no return. Of course, we're not the person or the people who do, who could say that we're at that point. That point of no return really depends on a lot of things. How long the person has been possessed by this demonic entity has a lot to do with it. Um, what we're dealing with is that we're dealing with a corpse. We're dealing with a person who has passed on.